Great, now we are inside my uh, sericulture shed and this is how I placed one of them. So there are, yeah, so this is how I placed, there are three lights like this. So this is a one foot, or one feet, I mean, uh, I don't know how you call it. This is a one feet uh, LED tube. So I'm going to light this up now. Great, here you go. So this is really, really bright. I mean, this is as bright as your uh, 40 watts tube light. Okay. So this actually, when it comes to life, and this this pretty much lights one part of my shed. Okay. Now, now I'm going to give you a couple of tips around, kind of you know. Uh, so, I mean, so selecting, I mean, the battery amp power or the lights and things like that. So. So using the volt and the using the old and the, the watts of these lights, I mean you can calculate the amps and a lot of online calculators. I mean which can let you know how long your battery would last. Uh, especially I liked one. I'm going to post the links uh, in the comments. I liked one which actually gives you what exactly you need. I mean because your charge controllers will automatically cut the power supply to the load when you are at 11. Point four five volts so so that is approximately like you no know, I mean most of the time this can act, it can still go down I mean the volts can still go down I mean so this pretty much treats that as 50 percent of the charge of the battery so that is to make sure your batteries stay kind of you know in good condition and not and we don't end up eating a lot of its charge cycle okay so it's so it's important that you choose the right battery size and the right uh, bulb size that you can actually afford to hang. So earlier, I mean, for the same number of lights, I used to have, um, I used to have a 14 amp hour battery, and that used to just die down in like you know two and a half hours. So because of which, I kind of you know recently upgraded to this uh, 42 ampere hour battery, and now it is lasting forever. I mean, we don't have to switch it off at all. I mean, these lights are always on in the night. So th this is an excellent project guys, I'm really satisfied with it a and I I'm sure I mean there are a lot of Indian farmers I mean who really can't afford a commercial license but still want to kind of you know light up their cow sheds or their sericulture sheds or the chicken sheds or any of these farmhouse uh, places. So I mean go for this one, I mean you go to YouTube, I mean eBay and you have a lot of these people who kind of you know have uh, these items at really really affordable prices so go for it put one together and if you have any questions please um, write to me I'll be glad to answer your questions thanks guys